Morning, everybody. Mike Bakke, PrincetonTrader.com, here for NTMarkets.com with your Monday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, S&P 500 E-mini futures daily chart. And what we're seeing this morning is some follow-through on the Friday strength. You can see the red line there, the 50-day exponential moving average. That was support on Friday. We broke back over the green line, the middle Bollinger Band, and closed right around the 9-day. The lows of last night, right on the Europe Open, down at 2098, we're in the area of the weekly pivot. The weekly pivot has been a pretty good guideline as to who is going to be in control of the tape during the course of any particular, you know, basically any particular week. Um, so far, weekly pivot is support. And as long as weekly pivot remains support, then the bear or the bulls rather are going to be able to, you know, extend back up into the 2112 area, which gave them some trouble, and back up into the 21.1975 area. Now, let me be clear. If this low from Thursday, which is a higher low from here and down here, if that's going to play out, then the bulls must make new all-time highs. They cannot stop short anywhere between here and 21.20. They have to make new highs. And if they really want to get the job done, they'll, they'll push in a pretty significant way because what we're seeing with the Bollinger Band with is you're seeing it dip down below two and a half. We're at 2.26 this morning. So the possibility remains if the bulls can get enough of a thrust higher that this could turn into a band ride to the upside. Um, but we are at step one of many steps of that. So that's just peering down the road towards the end of the week. What you need to focus on for today is do the bulls control the weekly period? pivot today. Can they close above it? Will it be challenged at all during the regular session? All right, everybody have a fantastic day. Follow us on Twitter at Princeton Trader. Check out the website, princetontrader.com. Come check out the chat room. I'll be back tomorrow morning with another webcast. Trade them well, everybody.